Hi, it's uh, Rick Iggy. I'm making this video uh, for uh, uh, the Facebook uh, page. And I'm inviting you to come to an event this coming Thursday, uh, I think it's the 18th of February. And I would like you to uh, help me figure out how I can uh, have a monthly uh, gathering and share what I know about microdosing, um, microdosing life. Uh, and I've been uh, involved in becoming aware of my consciousness since I was a little kid. It's been a major part of my life. Uh, and uh, I would like to, uh, to see if I can share with you uh, a form of holotropic breathwork that um, I fell on. It was like microdosing holotropic breathwork. And uh, that said, it's very important. I want to make the point that whenever you investigate your own consciousness, however you do it, it's always important to have a coach or a, a therapist or a guide or some trusted person uh, who will tell you the truth. Uh, because people can get really lost when they explore their consciousness in any way. Like, people run, you know, and, and they alter their consciousness through the effort of running. Or they take big risks, or there's all kinds of ways. Um, but people have visions on the inside, and in our society we don't talk about those things. We don't talk about our dreams, which is another way of, of altering your everyday consciousness and um, discovering things about your, your unconscious. So I, I hope you uh, get yourself a guide before you start doing that and we'll work out something for the people who, uh, who do come on Thursday uh, so that they've got somebody to talk to uh, about their exploring their consciousness um, and uh, someone who will tell them the truth, their truth. Because so, so many people now are messing with their consciousness, but they're, they're doing it with a, not messing, they're, they're genuinely trying to find out about themselves, <clears throat> but they're not talking about it. And really important to talk about it, to tell the story of the dream or the vision or, or whatever happened, at least three times, at least three times. And then you'll notice that the story that comes out of your mouth changes. Your understanding is seeping in. And uh, so I hope that if you enjoyed this, I invite you to try something. Rewind it and then listen to everything that I say but have it go to the little parrot inside your head so that you're listening to yourself say what you've heard me say. And that's a very important skill, and I'll be talking a little bit more about that on uh, Thursday. So I, I hope you can help me uh, uh, later by giving me advice on how I can do a better job of, of sharing the things that have made my life a lot easier. And I hope that you share the things that make your life easier. Like spread it around like that kid in that movie, uh, Pay It Forward. And so, uh, if you haven't seen the movie, by the way, it's, a, in my opinion, a really good one. So please share what makes your life easier, okay? So thank you very much for watching this, and thank you very much for coming. And if you feel like it, you can check out this website that my friend uh, Ben Gadbo has uh, been making for me. It's uh, rickgeggy.com. Uh, and I don't live in the money society. I love money, but I don't charge for anything. Because um, I, I just, I don't think the money, the way we do money these days doesn't work for most people. Okay, thanks a lot. Bye-bye.